Why I will not make adult films. I have a very popular page on Just for Fans. I'm actually in the top 1%, and I was in the top 1% at OnlyFans. I say that only because I am pretty successful on there, which still blows my mind because I'm 60, and I don't do anything extreme or weird. I'm just a real woman doing real life things that I enjoy. And 95% of it is just me and there's nothing weird or painful or anything about it. I really think that we need more women doing real porn like that. And there are men who really like it. They want to see the sensuality. They like seeing me in pretty dresses or just showing my body in different ways or talking to them in different ways that's really authentic. Now, why am I against um, women making adult porn? It's because there is very little money in it. Um, I know someone who is a uh, uh, who made porn. Uh, she does camming now, and she told me that she makes five. She made five hundred dollars per video, but if the women do something very extreme like anal or gangbangs, they can make a little bit more. But you basically, you can make maybe 500 or 1500 up to 2000 for a video. And then this video, you are exposed to any men. The whole population of men can see it. You don't get paid more per view. You get paid just for the video that you make. And you don't have any artistic license. You have to do what the director tells you to do. So I don't see that as female empowerment. In fact, when I have heard porn actresses talk in interviews, they say, I do not have sex like that with my boyfriend. It's fake. The women are often in pain. And some of them only get paid a few hundred dollars to make the video. Now, I make um, between 12 to 1500 a week on my just for fans and I don't have to do anything that's painful. I don't even have to have sex with guys. I don't have to be in any kind of pain, any kind of discomfort, and I have control over who sees it. Only the men who pay for access to my site, which I charge $35 a month, can see me. And there's a watermark. Um, I've never seen any of my videos uploaded to Pornhub or anything like that. If I did, I would uh, file a DCMA request to have it removed, but I feel like that's real empowerment. Um, also, for the, the way that they do the porn, I think is um, not helpful to men because it makes it seem like women are just like men sexually. I don't see any kissing. I need kissing. I need a lot of kissing to get turned on. I need the, men to, the man to hold me really tight and to be attentive to me. And um, I need a lot of things in order to get turned on. And in porn, it's just the director saying, do this, do that. And you're supposed to be turned on. Like the concept of the hypersexual woman who doesn't even respond like a real woman. Like it is... Uh, it is not real life. It completely is completely the opposite of what I think we need in sex education today. I think that men can get just as turned on seeing real women having real porn. And I think this whole industry of um, the commercial porn reminds me of when escorts used to work for an agency. You know, women can make much more money as in sex work having their own platform, like an OnlyFans, a Just for Fans, a Many Vids, or whatever. There is no reason for any women to make commercial porn. It is disempowering. It is, it's repulsive to me. It's gross. It's not even what a real woman likes. And I have a strong judgment against men who get turned on by that because if you get turned on, if you can't tell that the woman is faking it, then I feel sad for you. And if you can tell that she's faking it and that she's not turned on and you get turned on, I feel sad for you. 
I have had lesbians tell me they watch gay porn because it's real and they know that the, the men are really turned on. And what makes the porn really hot is seeing something sensual, something beautiful, and seeing a woman in her pleasure, like her real pleasure. Now, I'm not saying these women in the commercial porn never get turned on. Maybe they do. But I look at that I, as a woman and I'm like, ugh. <laughs> I have seen like some really sensual things that do turn me on and that's the kind of porn that I would like to see more and that's what some couples do in their kind of porn and I don't know, um, you know, like um, that's my view on it and that's why I don't want to do it. I think that women can be in their pleasure. In, um, the advantage of is like, okay, ladies, if you want to make porn, start your own porn page because you will have more pleasure, you will have more control over your desire and what you want to do, and you will make more money. I just think that it's exploiting, and the women that are in the commercial porn remind me of the women that go to work for an agency. I don't even think that's a thing anymore. Um, the only thing, if you make your own page, you have to find your own follower so you can start an Instagram page or... I don't even know anymore. I get most of my um, subscribers come off my Twitter or my escort ads. But um, I'm always kind of looking for like how what will turn men on. Sometimes I make videos of just getting myself dressed or, you know, putting on some lipstick or, you know, just bending over, just showing my body in different ways and beautiful lighting. And, you know, they like that. Men really like that. They don't need all that violence to get turned on. You can just show them a close-up of a body part and they'll get turned on. So, um, anyway, there are many men who enjoy that kind of stuff that I make, um, enough that I'm pretty successful at it. So, I hope that more women will start tuning into their own sensuality when they make their porn instead of what some director has them do for a subset of men who are turned on by the emotionless physicality of it. There are enough men that are more turned on by the whole central aspect of the entire woman and how she brings that into her content. And that's what I'm proud to be a part of. And that's why I don't mind making money off of. And on my porn page, I actually do uh, different educational videos. I talk about how to turn on a woman. I talk about what I really like and I do daily life videos like myself at the gym or when I'm cooking or getting ready for an appointment and men say they like that just as much as the nude ones because they like to see an aspect of the whole woman. So the men that just want to see a fake woman pretending to like something that is not my market and that is not a market I want. That is a market I abhor and I want nothing to do with those men. Nothing to do with those men. Nothing. They can just, you know, not in my space. And nothing against you if you like that, but I don't like that and I'm not going to be part of that or promote that in my work. So um, this was kind of a rant video. <laughs> uh, thank you for watching.